Can you um, briefly speak on paying for the funeral for a close relative of Shug and then Shug yeah. talking negatively? Yeah, that was a little different. So Shug had called me. Uh, he was trying to get his uh, the movie thing done. Mm-hmm. And um, I had some business going on. Um, some cats that ran a hedge fund. I think it was something to access to like $30 million or something like that to do the movie, but he needed some legal. And none of the attorneys would represent him because where he was out, he wasn't paying. And I think a few attorneys that got like indicted, mm-hmm. shit going on. So um, he knew I got my own relationships with my own attorneys. One of my attorneys, one of the top ones out here, Alex Kessel. Mm-hmm. So I called Mr. Kessel, told Mr. Kessel's situation. Castle tells me if I will guarantee the money, he'll work on it. So um, he goes down there and visits Shug in county jail and does all that. And the process of this happening, uh, Shug's mother passes. So, um, you know, I'm hearing rumors, but you know, you never know. Mm -hmm. Long story short, I get a call. You're like, yo. They selling dinners, family trying to figure it out, figure what out. Uh, my mother's burial. So I'm like, uh, you know, it's Shug Knight. I know it's a little rocky, but I don't know it's that rocky. I'm saying, you saying you ain't got the money to bury your mother? He like, I'm a little short. How short? He like, I'm, I'm tapped out. You know, first I gave him some thought. I'm like, you know what? Uh, go ahead on and see what you're going to do and, you know, let me know. Mm-hmm. So I let about three, four days go by. And I'm one of those dudes where a body needs to be in the ground in 10 days or it starts to get a little mm-hmm. messed up. Mm-hmm. So I called down there. Well, close female friend of Suge is keeping me updated mm-hmm. on what's going on. So I called out to the mortuary <clears throat> and um, I asked him, yo, what's the balance owed? Mm-hmm. Or what does it cost? It was like 15, 16,000, something around there. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, well, what's old? They're like, well, we're in contact with the family. They haven't brought us anything yet. Mm-hmm. So I had my wife, um, my t- I think we was I was supposed to go on vacation somewhere. I was supposed to do something with that money. Mm-hmm. But I told my wife the situation she didn't fight me on it, so my wife wired it um, by company. Fifth Amendment Entertainment paid for his mother's funeral, which is me. So I wired everything there. And um, then after the fact, I guess what do you call it, the repass came up. So I even provided the catering and paid for the location in Compton. It was like <clears throat> one of their centers down there in Compton to uh, have an after thing at. Um, so yeah, I definitely pay for all that. Then years later, he says, uh, yeah, Wax is nothing but a truck driver. Mm-hmm. So I asked myself, I'm like, shit, should I take that personal? The music mogul had to call the truck driver to cover the cost. Mm-hmm. So, you know, shout out to the truckers. At the time I was in music, I'd already had uh, some game projects out. Me and Ray G was very successful mm-hmm. <clears throat> with our projects. So, um, you know, I don't know, it was just a little different, man. It seemed to me like somebody covered the cost of my mother's funeral expenses. Um, I wouldn't be that way. I wasn't supposed to hear the recordings. I don't know who right. sent me the recordings. Somebody that should was on the three-way ads calling everywhere, I guess, had recorded him. Yeah. And, um, you know, they actually leaked him on the internet. Mm-hmm. Kind of tripped me out, but, you know, if you know Shug, you know him. You're going to like him for what you like him for, and you're going to expect other bullshit to come with it. Yeah. So, you know, I wish him the best.